what is Bilquis? According to Bi.org, Bilquis is one of the old gods, an ancient goddess of love and sexuality who feeds off her followers to keep her eternally young and powerful. Image, Lionsgate Television. Who is Succubus? According to NCBI, Succubus is understood as a Lilin demon in female form or supernatural entity that appears in dreams to seduce men, usually through sexual activity. 1. The descriptions of the same can be traced back to the folklore of medieval times. 1. The male equivalence of this is known as an incubus. Who is Jezebel? According to Encyclopedia Britannica, Jezebel was the daughter of the priest King Ethbal, ruler of the Phoenician cities of Tyre and Sidon. When Jezebel married King Ahab of Israel, ruled circa 874 to 853 BCE, she persuaded him to introduce the worship of the Tyrian god Baal Melkart, a nature god. Most of the prophets of Yahweh were killed at her command. So, the similarity <clears throat> between Bilquis, Bilquis, Succubus, and Jezebel is they feed off men and they use lust to conquer these men, right? <clears throat> Bilquis in the show American Gods, when she engages in sexual activity with men, she consumes them. Like she um, sucks them inside of her vagina. She sucks, she, she, she zaps their soul and gets all their energy. She feeds on them. Succubus is a djinn, is a female demon that comes to men and they sleep. Manipulate, manipulates, manipulates you, plays on your lusts, and, and misleads you. Same thing with Jezebel. Jezebel was a harlot. She conquered a lot of kings. She had a lot of prophets killed and a lot of righteous men. Brothers, sex is for procreating, making kids, pleasuring your wife and stuff if you're married. But being hypersexual, overabusing your body, always lusting, always having sex and ejaculating and stuff like that. Fellas, we have two life sources in our body. We have our prostate and we have our core. So the prostate is like this small, like a walnut. Same thing with your core which is your tailbone, like your core muscle, right? Those two is the nucleuses of our body. Our heart and brain is the batteries, right? That keeps the heart going. Some men see with their heart, some men see with their brain, right? But any anyway, <laughs> when you guys is constantly ejaculating, and y'all draining y'all prostate and y'all emptying y'all prostate out. And when y'all not strengthening y'all core and increasing your testosterone, y'all y'all zapping your life force. Y'all draining your life force and y'all aging yourself. And y'all actually cutting minutes and seconds and hours off on your lifespan. If y'all meet women are super hypersexual. Nine out of ten, these women was raped, molested, or played with when they was little, right? And when you meet women, a lot of times that always say, oh, I want a guy with a big penis. Nine out of ten, they've been getting grown man meat since they was 12. This blog is not about women, though. This blog is about how men, is about how men get seduced and misled and always lusting and then eventually get conquered or devoured because the demons who control these entities, the Jezebel, the Bilquis, and the Succubus, the demon, the chief demon who control these sub-demons, send them at y'all to mislead y'all off the path of righteousness, to throw off your mindset, to throw off your energy and your legacy. Fellas, be more mindful and um, 
have some discipline and some self-control. Everything that look good ain't good. And you got to see past the flesh. You got to be able to see a woman's soul. Because sometimes a woman look good external, externally, but internally her soul is rotten. And, and she's decrepit and, and she's, and you know, and she's um just very unattractive. And this apply to men too, ladies, when y'all meet hypersexual men. The, the, the male version of a succubus is an incubus. Incubus. So, women, this apply to y'all too. Don't let these dudes mislead y'all. These hyper lustful, hypersexual men mislead y'all and persuade y'all also. Everybody needs to practice discipline and self-control and, and deal with the higher chakras and strive to master yourself. You know, be in a world where things is getting serious and there's no time for people to want to be laying around butt naked and just laying up in bed having sex. Somebody might run in your, um, your fortress and snipe y'all while you 